as we all know, Kericho is actually the bedroom for the tea industry. What makes Kericho, Kericho is the tea industry. And uh, some of the issues that we have continued to raise is that, yes, there has been some increment in terms of bonuses and even prices per kilo, which is now going to two shillings. But we still have issues in the auction market in Mombasa. One of the things of notable concern is that we have not improved the technology that we use to test and create our tea in the tea auction in Mombasa. We, use, we still use the traditional method of actually using our tongue to smell, a nose to smell if this tea is okay. When you smell in that form, we don't know where you were sleeping last night. So are we sure that it's accurate, what you are smelling is correct? So we still continue to ask the tea industry, the tea players, to improve on the technology that we are using in the auction market. We look forward as Kericho being the home of tea. But at some point of time, we'll also have Kericho as the destination for the auction market. Because why Mombasa? We can also have a tea auction in Kericho. Mombasa is the traditional colonial tea auction. And what happens there, we don't know. So I look forward that some point will partner with the counties of Bamet and in South Riptia we partner with the areas that are growing tea and see if we can have our own tea auction board in Kericho here, which will be a subsidy of what's happening in Mombasa. It is part of growing the economy of our towns. As county governments, we commit ourselves that what we need to do as counties to help our farmers, one is to employ agricultural research extension officers. To this extent, we are committed to employ such extension officers who will help us to teach farmers on the best practices of actually maintaining their tea. The difference is the multinational tea estates, they harvest up to 1,500 kilos of tea per acre. But here at home in the villages, the same acreage gives us 600 kilos or even less. So the difference of 700 kilos is quite a lot and we will not take that, uh, you know, we can't continue watching that happening. Because as we push for the prices in the market, we must also push for the production to happen. And so we are going to employ research institutions officers to continue supporting the farmer. Uh, secondly, we know that our farmer is still stuck to the traditional clothes of tea, which they handed from the colonizer. This was what was done by our grandfathers. In 21st century, we look forward to partnering with the tea research and see how much we can support our farmer to get the best clones that are high productive and drought resistant. So that as we push for the prices up there to go up, we also push on the production in the tea farm and this will help us to move forward. Of course, tea is the major, major, major income earner in Kerijo County and even in Kipsiki as a general as a whole up to Bamet. And we look forward to commit ourselves to partner with Bamet and other neighboring counties to see that we push tea to the highest level and make the farmer get the best out of the production. So we could just say thank you for coming to Kericho and we feel good that they chose Kericho as a destiny of the celebration because what makes Kericho is the tea and this is the green county. Thank you so much.